Hi artists, welcome back. Today you will build your own doodle of an ocean. So I found this book and inside of it had different, uh, well, this one's my example so far. And inside of the book had examples of how to draw a bunch of different things related to the ocean. And it teaches you step by step. And um, this one is for the purple table. That's why there's purple up at the top and you'll share these um, packets with the people at your table. Please don't write on these packets. I'm using these with every class today, so no one else wants to see which one you're doing if you circle something, so please don't write on any of this. Um, and it has not only under the sea, but it also has above the sea too. So in the air, um, you can do tugboats, surfers, um, back underwater, submarine, or above water, a sailboat. Um, different types of fish, seals and sea otters, super cute. So you could even include lighthouse or birds in the sky like a seagull. So go ahead and um, flip through these when you get them and you'll start building your own doodle. So I only have a little bit more to go, um, but there's a couple of rules for today. You're going to use black Sharpie at first, and then you will add the color, baby. And of course, I want you to take your time and give your best effort today. Um, one of my rules for this project today is that you are adding a lot of detail. So there are almost no blank spots on my paper. I did notice I have a blank spot right here. So I do need to add something into that area. Um, maybe I will just do another one of these fish. And so just watch me as I draw for a moment and we'll continue talking about a few more of your guidelines and rules for today. You're allowed to change things up. For example, the eyes on this fish, I don't really like them. I don't wanna draw them like that. So I'm gonna draw it my own way. And if you wanna switch anything else up, of course, this is your artwork. As long as it's school appropriate, feel free to change things a little bit. Um, let's see, so we're going to color neat and complete. We will take these home today, so make sure you write your name on the back, probably with pencil. You don't want Sharpie to bleed through, so we'll just do um, names on the back with pencil. Okay, you'll take these home today. Um, while you're drawing, you'll notice, uh, like, I'm. if you make a mistake, like, this tail was supposed to go out a lot farther, it's okay. Just take a deep breath and keep going. Nobody is going to notice. I didn't even say anything and I bet you didn't notice. Um, no one's going to notice if you make a teeny little mistake. You do only get one paper today. So if you do make a mistake, um, like, like I just did there, try and fix it. It was supposed to go out a lot farther and now it does, voila. So try and fix it or try and turn it into something um, too. So, um, you'll build your own doodle today. You only get one paper. Take your time. Um, and then don't forget to add color at the end. Good luck, artists.